To elaborate what I was talking about earlier with regard to making sure that your subject is between you and the sun, it's very easy to look at this entire scenario and say, wow, look how pretty this is. Well, pretty to the naked eye, possibly, but pretty to a camera sensor, definitely not. I'm looking here and I'm seeing the beautiful tree there, a beautiful pasture behind, and it's pretty nice to the naked eye, but if you look closely at the shadows on Ashley's face, and Ashley just come this way, and then this way, you can see that those shadows are pretty nasty, so this, ladies and gentlemen, is not a picture. Put the camera down and find a place that you can take the picture properly. This doesn't work. Every time I'm with an assistant that wants to take pictures, this is what they do. They say, oh, here we go. This is great. And they go, oh, this is beautiful. And then when I see it later, it's unusable because of this. You can make this picture, but make sure you're in the proper place. What would I do? Well, again, I would come around this way and the camera's over there, but I would move Ashley towards me right there. I'd go back and I'd make the picture if the entire scene made sense, and if I looked at it from a three-dimensional standpoint, and it was a good photograph, I would go ahead and I would make it. But this, now the sun's out even more, you can see, guys, this is just not a picture.